So I get asked this question all the time. How do I record footage on my camera and audio on my microphone and play them back at the same time? So when you're watching my videos, you're hearing the microphone audio yet seeing the video from my camera. Very simple solution to this question. All we're doing here is taking a video file and an audio file and putting them into a video editing software and lining up the audio in the video and then deleting the audio from the camera. You probably know that cameras have microphones on them. So this one has a microphone. It's just, as you can tell, it doesn't sound nearly as good as this microphone. When I talk into the microphone, it sounds much better. The good news is there is a lot of free software out there that you can use to edit your videos. I just barely tried this one. I downloaded it. It's called VideoPad, made by NCH Software, and I just tested it out so it works. So I'm going to demonstrate that for you here now. Um, let's go to VideoPad, editor, do a new project. So most video editing software is going to look similar to this. You're going to have a screen here that shows the video that you're editing, and then there's uh, it's called a timeline that shows you know from zero seconds through the end of your video and then an audio track. And we're just gonna dump the audio and video track into this program and then line up the files so that the video and the audio are lined up. Um, I've got this little video track here. So you see this video track that I just dumped into here. By default, it has the audio of my camera. Um, and then I've got this, I've labeled it test audio. This is the audio from my microphone. So I'm going to bring my microphone audio and drag and drop it right here. And then I'm going to click on this plus button to expand this little track so I can see it a little better. So now what we're looking at is a video track with the default camera microphone audio right here. And then underneath it, I've got audio from my microphone. And you can see these little, they're called audio waves. Um, just these, this is what audio looks like when it's recorded. It's, it's kind of these bumpy, mountainous looking waves. Um, that's the sound of my voice being recorded. And you see in the microphone's audio, it looks pretty much the same. It's a little bit smaller because it wasn't recorded as loudly. But you can see the same bumps here as you do here. So we just need to line up these bumps so that it is, so that the microphone's audio is in sync with the camera's audio. And then once we line those up, we're gonna delete the camera's audio. Um, let's see what it sounds like right now. I'll just press play. Hello there, this is a test. This is a test. So they might actually be lined up. I made sure to press record on the camera and record on the microphone at the same time so I didn't have to fudge with it too much. So they might actually be uh, lined up. Let's mute this audio track. So I've just clicked on that button here and I've muted the audio track from the camera and let's see if the microphone audio is lined up with my uh, camera's video. Hello there, this is a test. This is a test. Yep, and if it wasn't lined up, let's say you pushed record on the camera and record on, you know, the microphone software at different times, that's fine. Just, uh, you know, line it up. Now it's a little bit quiet and most programs are going to allow you to turn up the volume, you see I've got this one turned all the way up to 100. Here's the volume meter. So I'm gonna right click on the track here and go to effects. And then I'm gonna click this plus button to add an effect and one of the effects is amplify. And I'm gonna turn it up by a little bit. Hello there, this is a test. This is a test. And then you see over here it shows the volume of my audio. You want to make sure that your volume isn't hitting zero or above because then it starts turning red. That means that it's distorting the audio a little bit and that doesn't sound very good. Now, if you're wondering how to make your voiceover sound better, I did make a video about that right here. So you might want to check that out where I go over um, a good free audio editing software that you can use to enhance your vocals a little bit, make them sound a little bit better. I talk about you know how to use your microphone properly so that you get the best sound that you possibly can. And that's it.